Hey guys, so I actually was just editing my video and I realized that I lost the footage for my intro. So you'll notice that I'm looking a little bit like casual and that I probably am going to be looking like this in two upcoming videos because I am filming two other videos right now. But um, I literally was just finishing this to upload this other video and I realized like where's the beginning of it. So I'm doing it now. So basically this is going to be my video on Boucler and Structube home purchases that I have and some of our favorite items. So um, I just want to mention because I think in one of these clips I talk about um, Ebates and getting cash back. So you can do that for Boucler, but Structube is actually not on the Ebates website. Um, I just wanted to make sure that that was clear. But yeah, this is all of our home decor that you would have seen in my house tour. Me explaining it in more depth, all of the items that we got from Boucler and from Structube. So if you guys are interested to see what those items were, I do actually list the price of all of those items in this video as well, um, in case you guys are curious and hopefully that helps you out. But um, yeah, here you guys go. All right, you guys, so I'm going to start with Boucler, and I'm going to start at the front of my house. So actually, this console table and this mirror are both from Boucler, and I just thought they went perfectly together. Um, these were very affordable, or at least fairly. I guess I should say fairly affordable. Um, so I will have everything, both for Structube and Boucler. As long as I can find them, I'll have them linked below. Um, but yeah, this is the entryway to our house, and we got both this mirror and console table from Boucler. The console table has kind of a distressed wood look. Um, I actually would have preferred if it was a little bit more black, but I do still really like it. And again, I love what the black kind of cast iron decals. It matches a lot of the modern decor in our home. And it matches the rim of our mirror. So both very modern features, nice and sleek. So this console table is very thin, which is exactly what I wanted. I didn't want it to come out from the wall too much. So the next two items that I have here are our bar stools that we have sitting at our kitchen island, which are also from Boucler. So again, bar stools actually can be expensive. Even at Boucler, there are a few that are quite expensive, but we again waited for a sale. So this sale was, I believe, 70% off. Again, I'll have the pricing linked below. I just don't want to, you know, guarantee you guys that these are going to be the same price as what it's what they're listed as because we do really try to watch for things and buy them when they are on sale and I highly recommend doing that <laughs> and also purchasing through Ebates which I always have linked down below even if I'm in the store and I see something I like I'll still go online and purchase it through Ebates just because I get the cash back so love these bar stools the only problem with these is because of the black bases and our dog the bases often look very dirty <laughs> So you will notice that a lot of the art in our house is actually from Boucler. I just find they have a really good selection and it can be fairly affordable, but I will say it can also be expensive. So what I usually do is I look for things that are on sale. So this piece is actually, I'm trying to show you how, it's very large. Um, and this was $80. Most of the pieces that we have are kind of that canvas material, but I mean $80 for a print this size is actually not bad at all. So in our one spare room, we also have this canvas print that was also from Boucler. So this I do remember paying full price. Um, I believe it was $100, which can be a little bit pricey. But again, it's a little bit hard to show you guys the size of this. But I will have it linked below for the dimensions. And again, if you're smart, you'll just wait for the sales. I just, this is one of the first things we bought in our last house. So I was kind of just excited to furnish. Um, but again, it's a really good, nice size print. And I believe this is the last um, kind of piece of art that we have from Boucler. So we always joke, this is the parve. This is our fancy art piece, even though, again, it was fairly affordable. And this one is cool. It's actually made of, you know, a wood slabs um, and kind of like a rustic painted look. And again, I'll try my best to find these pieces to link them down below. This one I don't actually remember the price of, but I know it was around, it was under $100. I want to say closer to $75. But again, art can be quite expensive and it's really not a bad price. All right, guys, this is the last item that I have to show you from Boucler. So again, it's very similar to the console table. Again, it's kind of like a 
tarnished black wood material. I did just wipe it down so you might see a few streaks here. Um, and then again with the same kind of black legs. And sorry, that's a Christmas gift that Matt still has underneath the table. Um, but this is a really good size. And I believe we paid about $100 for this. But again, I did buy it on sale. I'll try to link this one down below as well. But for this size, like it's really hard for me to show you. Again, the dimensions will be listed in the link down below. Uh, but this was a really good find for the price. All right, you guys. So let's start with Structube. So I will say I don't have a whole lot to show you from Structube, but I did want to include it in this video just because it kind of fits with the same idea. So the first thing I want to talk about is these two prints. So this is actually the same print, but we bought two of them and we flipped them. So one is one way and one is kind of upside down, I guess. So these were on sale when we bought them. I think they were $69 each. Again, these are really good sized prints. It's very hard to show you guys on video, but these are quite large and that's a really good price. So these were the first things we've actually ever purchased from Structube. So the next thing I wanted to show you guys is these planters. So we actually bought these, they come in a set of three and that's something that I love that Structube does. They often sell things like planters or containers, baskets, things like that. They kind of go together. So these three that I'm gonna show you are all the exact same but different sizes. So this one here for our snake plant is the medium size. This one here is the large, so you have to ignore this corner because we're still kind of doing some work. It's, um, well, you can see it's a little bit of a mess, but this is the largest one. And this one here is the smallest of the three. So again, they all came together. They come in different colors as well. Um, by the way, if any of you guys have any tips, my plant is not looking good and I'm not sure what I'm doing wrong. <laughs> But again, such a good find for the price. Again, I'll try to link it down below, um, but pots and planters can be so expensive. It's really quite crazy. So it's nice that these kind of came together. They all match and they're more of an affordable price. Okay guys, and the last thing I want to show you, it's very hard to show, <laughs> um, but this is actually a mattress that we bought from Structube. And the cool thing about this is it's like those ND mattresses where they actually come in a small box folded up and then you kind of like unfold it. Sorry, we just had someone stay over. <laughs> um, you kind of unfold it and it kind of blows up. Um, so this was a really good find for the price. Mattresses can also be quite expensive. Um, so I was a little bit worried too that the quality would not be great. But we have heard from, we've only had two people stay on it so far. And they said it was really comfy. So we are going to get a box spring. You'll see that this is a little bit low. Um, but yeah, great find from there for a good price. All right, guys, I actually forgot about my laundry hamper that I got from Beauclair. So this is like kind of a random thing to add in, but I did want to add it in because this was $17. So again, I did wait for it to go on sale because these can be expensive, which blows my mind. It's such a simple thing. Um, mine's full of clean uh, clothes right now. Um, but it's so easy and very like, it's very well made. So what I like is that the handle, like you could, it, this is never going to rip off. And it's just so much easier than those hard plastic ones to kind to carry around the house um so yeah this was a great find and 17 dollars is a really good price for one of these